Have you ever heard one of those stories about someone who thought they heard from God, but they actually didn't? And then there's all the damage and fallout that goes with it. Or perhaps you've been one of them. You thought you heard from God, you made steps of faith, and then circumstances backfire. Can we trust the voice we hear? We read stories like this throughout the Bible. All the significant characters heard from God and acted on it. Somehow they had learnt to recognise God's voice. The Bible says that Adam and Eve heard the sound of the Lord God walking in the garden. But what does God sound like? Knowing God is a real relationship. So hearing His voice is not about perfecting a technique. Spend 15 minutes a day, take these three steps or use this formula. It's not about getting guidance or having a prophetic dream. When He speaks to us, there's something He requires from us. You're receiving power for miracles. You are partnering with God's plans on the earth and you're entering the faith zone. Ask yourself, am I willing to hear whatever God says? I can hear Him say yes, but can I hear Him say no? It's not difficult to hear God's voice. God wants us to hear from Him and He is committed to making His messages clear. It was never meant to be a one-way conversation.